Today we'll be showing how to remove a pilot bearing. Although this procedure will work on almost any pilot bearing or bushing, we'll be demonstrating it on a Suzuki Samurai clutch assembly. We realize that on this particular engine, the flywheel could be removed and the bearing driven out from the back side. However, some pilot bearings and bushings are pressed into the crankshaft and must be removed with a puller or the more inexpensive approach that we will show here. All that's needed is some bread, a bolt, and a brass hammer. Select a bolt that fits snugly inside the bearing. If the bolt is too small, it could be wrapped with electrician's tape to make it fit better. In our example, we used a 10 millimeter bolt that fit well enough without electrician's tape. Pinch off small pieces of bread and pack them inside the bearing. Moist bread works best. Using the bolt, push the bread through the bearing, filling the cavity behind. Continue forcing bread through the bearing until the cavity is completely full. Once the cavity becomes completely full, pound on the bolt with a brass hammer. As the bearing begins to work its way out, you'll need to add more bread to the cavity. Continue adding bread and pounding until the bearing comes out. And that's how to remove a pilot bearing with bread. Some people use grease, but we found bread to work just as well and is much less messy. Once the bearing is out, remove the bread with a screwdriver. That concludes today's presentation. Thanks for watching and join us again soon for another low range off-road tech tip video.